So guys. In March 2020, my life would change forever. I went into March like a normal month and went out of it with no school and therefore no life. April 2020 was very different from November of 2019. In September 2019, I have just started grade 6 and things were like normal. I was in elementary school and I knew what I was doing. The school I went to had just gotten the new building extension and I was very excited about the second floor and the stairs. It was March 2020 and it was normal until the March break came. Within that March break, I was expecting to go to California and finally get to visit my dad who left Canada two years ago now. I was expecting to have the best adventure. I was expecting to go to California at all. But on March 11, 2020, which is the day before we were going to meet my dad, we saw news about the first case in California. I was really upset and concerned that I might not get there because COVID cases might explode in the US, which it did. On March 12th, 2020, we were about to go to California. We even had everything packed. But last minute, Mom said, Sorry, we aren't going. I was very sad. I even posted a video called I'm Sorry on my YouTube channel. The day. This ruined me and I was pissed about it for the next few weeks. To this day, the plane ticket hasn't expired yet. As for school, we got a weekly Google Meet chat with our grade 6 teacher named Mrs. Madge. And we also got way too much homework. When I was at school, I thought up stuff to do at home. When I'm at home all the time, I can't think of stuff to do at home because I'm already at home and I can't be reminded about anything. During quarantine, I've learned a lot of new things and spent lots of time playing games such as chess and cribbage, making homemade poutine and donuts with my mom, and watching movies with my mom and my stepdad. When grade 7 started in September 2020, I was in a weird rudimentary school named Virtual Academy, which for some reason isn't part of It was basically school, but it depended on services such as Google Meet and Hapara. After school and the summer break, grade 8 started. Sure, we still had to wear masks and take precautions, but it's much better now than it was one year ago. In November 2021, the actual main virus isn't really a problem anymore, and the Omicron variant was starting to go wild. We would still stay in physical school for another month until December 17th, and everything seemed fine. And during Christmas break, the Omicron variant was really starting to take off, and when the Christmas break was over, we all went back to online school for a few weeks, but now I'm back in class. I hope that all variants are gone by mid-2022 and things go back to normal so that everyone can have a proper vacation. Over the pandemic, I've made so many memories, such as watch movies with my mom and make cakes. We even made some beaver tails. Those are some good memories that will never be forgotten. The end.